Today I'm going to share with you something that I just realized today and I think it's really going to help with my Knit 2 Pearl 2 rib stuff. Um, we'll see. So it's, uh, if I'm wrong, please correct me, but this is what I've discovered. So what I've done in the past is I'll, I, I usually knit English style. So that means the yarn is in my right hand. So the rib stitch has taken me a long time because I have to do it this way. If it's just a knit stitch, I can do continental, meaning I can have the yarn in my left hand like this. I can pick up my stitches like that and it's so much faster, but in the past, my purl stitches are awkward and honestly, my tension isn't as great on them, so I've just given up on this method for rib stitches because it takes so much longer to do it like this. That was the past. Today, oops, see, this is why I've not enjoyed doing it this way. I love continental stitches with knits, but not with pearls because they're awkward. They take so much longer. But today I realized that I could do it. <laughs> See, it's just painful. I realized I could do it a different way. Now, correct me if I'm wrong. So that's a knit stitch. Here's the purl stitches. Instead of going that way, I'm gonna go underneath and pull my stitch through. Now, in the past, I've tried this, but then I realized it's twisting my yarn. But today, I realized it doesn't matter because if you keep purling your stitches that way, they look the same. The only difference that I can tell is on the inside, and it kind of looks like a... Uh, a knit front and back. So these are my old purl stitches. And then this is the new one. So they do look a little bit more twisted. But that's the inside of the hat. On the outside, I can't tell a difference. Can you see that? So I would not recommend this if it's a front and back project, like if you have a right side and a wrong side, but if it's in the, if it's in the round, you can't tell because it would be on the inside. But I personally like how that looks. So I will, and this is going to be a, a flip brim. So I'm going to unfortunately keep doing my old, English style for the first, you know, several inches. So that when the brim is flipped, it looks like that classic rib stitch. But then once I get to the middle of the hat and you won't see it when it's flipped, I think I'm gonna go to my new style. Now, like I said, correct me if I'm wrong, but I, I think that's so much simpler. <laughs> um, I mean, I'm still getting used to it, but oh my gosh. So much simpler, she says. Oh my word. Well, oh my gosh. This is the fun thing about knitting. There's always something to learn, always something to improve on. And this is also why I enjoy knitting with bulkier yarn so much more. So, all right, let me know what you think. Is this how you've always done your pearl stitches? Am I just a uh, late learner? Let me know.